Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20 and welcome to episode 15 of Direwolf 20's server play series. Apparently, Soren crippled the server last <laughs> night and it's been slow and laggy all day because Soren's a noob. So Soren. And then I logged in and fixed it. But, I but, will show you what I did if you right. come over to the so, what did you do? middle room. Go upstairs and middle room one farther away. You'll see. Upstairs, middle room. Yeah. Okay, this room? Yep. All right. Okay. So see how the is the shooter set up? Yes. Imagine that. What? Why would you? Why would? Why would you? Why? Because they're going to feed into the other things and distribute the cobble depending on what's needed. However, I decided okay, this is not enough for over here, so I dismantled all of it and realized that I didn't turn off the cobblestone machine. This was not enough for what? Uh. No. Uh, basically, the way I set up. I couldn't feed power into it without getting in the way of the rest of the room. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> kind of had to dismantle it. So, Soren Derp is a derp. Pretty much. Also, and is I it both it, raining and cold. snowing in this biome? Yeah, I don't know. I did not know that until after I started building. Well, I knew you were a derp before you started building, but... <laughs> no, I mean, like, is it raining and snowing in the same point? Like, if you come out over here, it seems uh, to me like it's no, raining it's and snowing. Extreme Hills, River, and Maplewood combination. It's basically on the borders. You'll see both. I'm. It's telling me I'm Maplewood all over the place. Well, there's River. Okay. Yeah. River is rain. Maplewood is snow. Extreme Hills is snow. Okay. But since the biome's not square, it's all over the place. So basically, did you have all those things running? Yeah, they run into iron pipes. They all disperse right into this barrel. Really? That's like the worst yeah. build you could possibly do. I was trying to work through it, and it was too late to really to understand what I was doing. So. Like, <laughs> short was, of sending that through a mistcraft portal to an unloaded chunk, like, that's the worst that thing you could do. That was so poor Eddie. Poor yeah. Eddie, indeed. Somebody else did that. That was the worst build imaginable on the server. <laughs> that's the worst build ever, and it's you can't beat that. Like, you could not make a laggier build no. if, you, if you said, hey, Dyer. I want to make the laggiest build possible because I want to troll a server. I couldn't come up with something better than what he did by mistake. But you're you're like a close second. <laughs> yeah, I need a miscraft portal to mimic it, but yeah, pretty much there. All right. So what are we working on today? Well, I'm going to work on cobblestone work, so at least I can have building materials for everything. Cobblestone like works. The uh, everything you get from cobblestone, stone, brick, etc. Oh, so you're going to like. Make like the glass and brick and stone yeah. factory thing. Yeah. That'll be a little bit harder without pneumatic tubes. That's what I was thinking yesterday. That's how I made this mistake, but I think I figured it out. Yeah, you realize that build craft pipes don't back stuff. That's what happened to you, huh? Oh, yeah. Nice. So, recapping last episode, I did a whole bunch of auto crafting fun stuff. Um, if you need any auto crafting of vanilla stuff that would make your life easier, let me know and I can do that. Uh, failing that, I'd like to get some kind of quarry up and running. Yeah. <laughs> um, like, I would like to do the, the the quarry with blood magic. I really want that to be our quarry technique. Um, but that's going to require a fair bit of investment on our part. Though, you know, to be fair... Hmm. Like, I don't think we're in a position yet. What is this? It's a full guard pattern. Okay, cool. I don't know why. Oh, yeah. but... Fireball left that for us. Fireball leaves weird things for us, doesn't he? It does. I'm going to take this ready and put it in our AU system. Fireball, you leave weird things for us. I just want you to know that. <laughs> okay. I'm okay with that, though. You're okay with that. I'm, I'm fine with it. That's fine with me. As long as we can use it. Maybe. All right. So, yeah, Soren, what I'm thinking is I, I really want to use blood magic for our mining system, but that's going to require a fair bit of infrastructure. I'm not sure if we're at that point yet that we can do that. So should we come up with something else in tilt? Stop it. Um, or should we work towards blood magic and get that up and running? We, we, we we'll definitely need some quarry. kind of automated way to accumulate yeah. life essence. Um, if we could mm. find some witches, because I remember witches in an area would, like, regen faster than they would get damaged. How do you plan on picking the witches up? With any one of the ten blocks and mods that can pick up entities and move them around. Such as... Because Golden can, Lasso? Because I can. 
The lasso doesn't work in the hostel, I don't think. Sure it does. Uh, did last night. Yeah. <laughs> it didn't? That's what they were telling nope. me. <laughs> so how do you pick up? You That's can't what pick I up. asked you! Um, I don't know. I'm sure you told me 10 mods, but then you listed one. Well, MFR has something, but we don't have MFR yet. Okay. <laughs> Next. I'm sure we'll figure something out. All right, okay. so failing witches, then how else can we cheat to get life essence that'll make way of time nerf the mod? I don't know. Uh, witches are easy to get, just as long as we can figure out how to pick them up. Name right. a zombie. Put what? it on top of... I, I saw a design like this, okay? Um, the Tinker's Construct uh, graveyard soil, I think it is called, it yes. um, heals undead when they Correct. walk on it, but they have to be moving. So I saw oh. a design that had a zombie in the center that was named, so it didn't despawn. And then there was a villager in a minecart circling it, so it kept walking. <laughs> and that was inside a well of suffering. That's funny. I should test that. I kind of like that idea. We it was an angry zombie? No, just normal. Just, just any zombie. Angry zombie would get bigger. Or is that furious? Furious. That's bigger. furious, but maybe furious would have like more health regen. Well, they have so much health. But they they have a lot of health, bigger. but I don't know about health regen. If they had uh, good health If they were really regen. big, I suppose they could touch more than one of the blocks. Yeah. And they would also probably suffocate if we build it wrong. I'm going to go test that in single player and see what kind of fun I can have. I'll be back in a minute, guys. All right, guys. One thing we're doing right now is uh, I stole the Tesseract that we're using to do stuff, and we're going to clear out an area for what will be our blood magic stuff. Whoa. So that... Go. Yeah. Should be clearing out some stuff. Nice. Uh... Okay. So... I'm going to let this clear the terrain here, and then that will lead into our blood magic area, where we will have a, an altar and a mob farm and a couple, a couple cool, awesome things. All right, we'll be back in a few minutes. So, guys, we're back, and I just found a really interesting bug with Morph. <laughs> um, if you log out of the server while you're in the middle of morphing, when you log back in, you're stuck at whatever hearts you were at when you logged off. You should show them. What? You should show them. They can see it right now. I have five hearts. Like, that's my max health. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, right now, my max <laughs> health is five hearts. But I'm still stronger than you, so let's go, buddy. Can I borrow that sword? No. <laughs> no, you cannot. Darn. <laughs> and then when I switch back to bat mode, now I have half a heart. <laughs> Which I feel like is probably a bad idea. <laughs> So that's a bug that I reported to Aichen, and he will be working on pretty soon. So as a workaround, I came up with the solution to just cheat myself some red heart canisters. So I think my max health right now is actually four and a half hearts. You'll see that when my hearts heal up, like I can't get any more than four and a half, um, even if I eat, which I'm doing now. So this is the room that you're building for us, Soren, by the way? Uh, it's the tunnel. At the end of it, will spread out however you need it. So if you need, like, a 9x9, nine nine, we'll okay. it. Yeah, so this will just be for our blood altar area. Um, that'll be good because eventually, it it'll probably eventually be Cursed Earth. And when that happens, we don't want to have a bunch of zombie and skeleton sounds near our base. Just like, you know, the last series, yeah. we want to keep that separate. So. Also, I checked out some blood magic rituals, and they got some cool, nifty updates going on. I wanna—I'm excited to show people what's new in blood magic. Um, so yeah, my solution is five heart canisters, which will get me up to I think a max health of nine and a half. So that's a little bit less, but I guess that's gonna have to work around until Ichun fixes it. At which point, uh, I'll remove the heart canisters and delete them from my inventory so that exists to fix a bug all right we'll be back in a minute all right guys we are back soren how's that room working out it's big it's nice i like it all right that's good, good. dude so do you want to change out the walls later do you want the altar to be into the ground so that like the altar is like right here that would probably be best and then okay. we just walk up, have the mob spawner up above it, or... So I'm guessing this is the center of the room. You've already mapped that out for me. Yep. Cool. I know you in centers. Yeah. Well, you know what? Centers are hard. I've actually found that I've gotten pretty good at being able to, like, find the center of something, roughly. And I'm usually within a block or two. I just love the torches you just placed. <laughs> Thanks. 
I like the floor you placed. I, I know. Look at that. I just placed the floor. You didn't tell me to place foundation. There's a difference. Right. <laughs> Someone in my chat was you... saying, you should probably fill that up with fill. And I was like, nah. Nah. I don't know. I have and a block that will automatically fill this in for me, but nah. Nah. I don't think we have enough wood for that. Fireball would probably kill us if I get over there again. Yeah, I have no wood at the moment. Yeah, I took six stacks last time I was there. I told him three. Thanks. <laughs> you were quite welcome. You told me to take as much as you need. That was your mistake. Yeah, that was all your mistake then. You've seen me play. You should know Fireball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should absolutely know. Wait till I give him a bound pickaxe. <laughs> the dice are gonna have a fun time. Uh, okay. I'm just trying to navigate this labyrinth that Soren calls a, a room. I made a floor, I didn't make <laughs> the rest of it. That was natural. Did you get a blood rune? Uh, yes, it did. Okay. Okay. I need to drop that magnet one near you. Yeah. No. Okay, it's on the ground. Magnet. Where Thank are you? you. Here you are. Welcome. Um, and then I believe. Now what we're looking at is this. This doesn't have to be. These bricks, by the way, it can be anything. Okay. Ah, okay. So if you want, I can make it this. Yeah, we can always change it later if we ever need to. That's nice. Is that cool? Yeah. Can I give us a tessellation look? I mean, we can even fill in this stuff here, too. Like, we don't need this open. Oh, okay. So, I don't know if you want to do that. Uh, what I might do is, not immediately, but put drawbridges so we can always change what type of rune it is. Yeah, we're going to want to upgrade the runes. Uh, the, the more upgraded runes are more expensive, and I kind of just hurried through the, the, the crafting part of it. Right. To get all so the stuff that we need to open for the moment. Yeah. Okay, that's cool with me. Uh, so we've got a tier 3 altar. Hooray! Yay! I've been using the altar in the workshop to kind of do some things. So I think that's enough for now. Like, uh, we can eventually get to a tier 4. It's not that hard to get to, but I'd rather use the altar in the workshop for any tier 4 needs that we have. And then this will, um, like, we should be able to... Oh, I have F7 mode on. We should be able to install the Well of Suffering here and, you know, get this at least to a point where it's working. And frankly, we could have multiple altars if we wanted to at some point. Dire. Yes. PvP on. Oh. <laughs> Fire cutlass. Look at you. Yeah. All right, Fireball, I'm going back. So here's uh, a question. Can I break my gravestone? I uh, you need pickaxe. Oh, sorry. I'll be there in a minute. You know, I had that. I had. I had the feeling that that was coming. <laughs> I was told to in chat. So many times. Yeah. I feel like dying has fixed my health issue. Okay, so there we go. Chat was on the right track here. We need to fix I should go problem. tell iTunes that. <laughs> I'll be right back. Sorry, kill you. All right, guys, we're back. So what I'm going to do is I think we decided we're going to keep the altar tier 3 for now, Soren, because I just don't really have the resources to upgrade it. But I'm going to use the uh, resources at the workshop that I think we have time mostly set up um, for this purpose. So what, one of the things I want to get is a weak activation crystal so I can activate some rituals. So I'm going to need a lava crystal. So I just need any orb, glass, obsidian, and diamond. Oh man, it's killing me that I can't shift click this, by the way. Huh. That stinks. Glass. Diamond. Well, I had a tier 4 orb. <laughs> Not sure. Alright guys, so we're back. Uh, so, Way of Time built a nice altar down here. And the nice thing about it is he put a lot of runes of self-sacrifice in there. So it really helps to fill up the altar when you're using this thing. Aha! Found your, found your orb, Zorin? I did. <laughs> nice. 
So first thing I want to do is toss this guy in here, and that's going to get me a weak activation crystal, I believe. It's slow, though, because there's no speed runes on it. Um, and then the other thing I wanted to... Well, once I get that, then I can get a blood shard, which is why I have a diamond sword here. I want to get a bound sword. And how much do I have an LP? I have a good amount of LP going on. Cool. Hmm. 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 <laughs> I'm going to sit way over here. That's probably wise. <laughs> I do believe last time we got him set on fire. No, uh, what? did you see me kill him? <laughs> and I, it, it isn't, no, it's not an, it's not a activation ritual underneath anymore. I don't he, even know what ritual it is. He, it looks like, I don't know which one it is, but it's not the, the activation ritual. Does anyone have an activation ritual handy, or should I make some ritual stones? Alright, I think I'm going to have to make some ritual some. stuff. All right, guys, I'll be back in a minute. I have to upgrade some of these things. I don't know what that is. So what I have to do, actually, is make ritual stuff. Uh, so I need reinforced slates. Okay. And I have to figure out how many. And you know what? I'd really like to have a ritual diviner while I'm at it. Uh, so this doesn't look too bad. Uh, all right, I'll be back in a minute. I'm going to go get the stuff I need for this. All right, guys, I think this should be easy to make. Let's see, that should be 1,000 LP in there. And I think it's 1,000 LP. Nope. Isn't it 1,000 per each of these inscription deals? Yeah, it is. So, oh, wait, but it, yeah, okay. So, yeah, that's good. So, that worked. What's so, the name of that one? Cuts. Which one? That's uh, okay, cuts. I'm doing it down here just because I happen to be here, and then I realized we don't have the regen flower, and we don't have the ritual stones, and that's just not as good. Something top. What was it? Piston top. Oh, okay. There we go. Hopefully enough. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, sad face. Ha. Ah. Almost enough. But not quite. All right, I'm doing this back at the workshop because this is not going to work here. Piston top brigade. Wait. What? Piston top brigade. You'll see it in the workshop. I'm afraid to see what you're talking about. No, it's perfectly safe and fine. Are you sure? Not dangerous at all. Well, I was until you had asked that. Piston top brigade. Yeah. Not bad. All right, let's see if my uh, stuff's done cooking yet. It does not appear to be yet. Ready. <laughs> All right, we'll be back in a minute. I want to wait for those things to finish before I use oh. the ritual. Soren, are you a chicken? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was. <laughs> and you realize that might not be a smart move? <laughs> Two hearts is not fun. You stay away from me, sir. No. <laughs> <laughs> ha, ha, ha. So, by the way, I just went and got a few speed runes, and I'm going to replace the runes around here just to hopefully yeah. speed this up. I don't know what that was. We speak. I don't know what that was. But what now? Someone typed in chat that made no sense with letters. Oh. So I assumed it was like just the symbol kind of speaking. All right. So let's see. Is this faster now? I th I feel like that's improved. Good. Ha. Huh. All right. We'll be back in a minute. I want to wait for these things to finish cooking, and then we can build a ritual. That's true. So Alright guys, we're back. So I got all the dye things that I need. These guys are running around doing weird things that, I, that frankly Piston confuse me. Piston Hat Brigade. Piston Hat Brigade? Let me see. Oh, <laughs> right. Piston Hats. <laughs> Piston Hats. Oh, these are the people that I spend some time with. I'm not sure why. Wait, Wait, you with yeah, I got withered. Ah. Look at that! Why do I have withering? Because I'm a wither skeleton. When you're a wither skeleton, you have the withering effect? Oh my gosh! It's the best thing ever! I don't know well, that I like that. Punch things. Why I do you get to be a withering fire. effect? Oh my gosh. 
Okay, so Wither Scouts are supposed to die in the light, but they're remo immune to fire. Right. I like it. Yeah, it's like the zombie pigmen. They set on fire for a split second in the sun, then go out. <laughs> that is like, uh-uh. Uh-uh, not at all. Alright, so let's get the Ritual Diviner. I think I've got everything I need for it, too. And once we have that, then we'll be in really good shape. See, first cuts. So, mm, number one, Ritual good. Diviner. Yes. It's a matter of blue, blue, <sighs> red, green. Okay, but this guy's a little tall. <laughs> nice. Ritual Diviner down. And then I need some Ritual Stones. Uh, of course, I can't shift click that, can I? For some yeah, reason, I still have Way of Time's Master Blood Orb. I'm not really sure why. Oh, yeah, I stole it from <laughs> the altar, because he left it in the altar. Yeah. Not my fault. Oh, because we were using his sigil, and he wanted us to refill it. Oh. Right. Like that was going to happen. All right, so for a ritual of binding, which I think I'm going to build at the workshop so other people can use, um, I'm going to need a total of... Uh, 8, 4, 4 is 8, 16, 20, 24 total runes. So I've got 16 of them so far. And I think the things I have cooking back at the workshop should be enough to get me enough. Hi. Where do you go? I don't like that you have flight. <laughs> I know, everyone just keeps throwing me things. It's amazingly wonderful. <laughs> Everybody's like, here, Soren, have all the toys. We know that you get killed by Dyer a lot, so take these items. And Cuts is amazing because he keeps giving everyone but you the Traveler Boots. I noticed Everybody that. Everybody who doesn't already have a sash and stuff, to be fair. <laughs> I, did, I did, like, rush to the sash because I like the sash. But unfortunately, the sash, like, stops working every time I log off or switch dimensions. But here I can just go up and do boop, and, and then you have withering. The thing about yeah. the boots is the boots don't I didn't get withering from that, by the way. Those. Oh, okay. There might be certain random changes. Cuts, I need you to come back to your house and modify your door for us. <laughs> or you could just move. That's... That's clearly what I should be doing, but, you know... Okay, there we go. Oh, I need a favorite, that one. What's that? The skeleton. Yeah. All right, so now I should be able to buddy. <laughs> so Details. orb in the middle and we should consider, well not yet, but we should consider soon making more obsidian. All right, so I should be able to make the ritual of binding now, Soren. Okay. And we should really work on upgrading our own blood altar, so I don't have to run back and forth to the workshop for stuff like this. Uh, where should yeah, I set up the ritual of binding? I'm thinking they should be outside, right? Uh, the workshop, yeah. Yeah. Like. Probably sound safe. I don't know why there's trees randomly out here, but they should probably go away. I'm not getting really hurt that much. Um. Yeah. Maybe just right here-ish. I'm just gonna try this and see how it works out. So let me remind myself how the ritual binding needs to look because it's actually a little bit into the ground. So ritual binding needs to be one, two, three, one, two, three. I believe this is right. And then this is broken. One, two, three, and then broken. One, two, three, and then broken. Oh, I'm in quicksand. <laughs> I hate biomes as plenty as quicksand. It's so terrible. <laughs> Not helping. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, that's right. Oops. <laughs> um, and then, like, I believe it's this one that gets broken. Or maybe it's this one actually looks a little bit better. Here's the word dough of playing in the sand. Indeed. So 
Someone's confusing me now. I love how now. sand... Yeah, well, it's just one... You didn't place anything here. I like how sand falls in quicksand slower, just like any other entity. Yes. So let's try it. Ritual of Binding, and we'll see if this shows up. Go! Go. Ritual of Binding. <laughs> Go. <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> <laughs> Did I map it out wrong? I like it. Go. Oh, oh, it's not working. Maybe it'll work now. Oh, no. Oh, uh, yeah, oh. I did. Okay, I did map it out wrong. I, I counted oh. three, it should have been two. Yeah, I did help. <laughs> Inadvertently. Dun 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 dun. Alright, so that should be a ritual of binding. Do 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 do. Yeah. Yeah. You want to hurt an innocent wither skeleton with the You feel pull, but you are too weak to push any further. Oh, wait, it's not owned. Okay. There we go. Check that out, Soren. Wow. Is that cool? Yeah, that's not a particle effect, but nice. Ah, I don't need that. Oh, you know what? I think when we had that bug earlier with items getting dropped, I turned on magnet mode. Let me turn that off. No, I have you have your on. magnet off? I turned it off now. Oh, but there we go. Standing back. It's pretty cool looking. Oh, yeah. And I like how it kind of, like, disappears when it's done. And I think every ritual has different, like, circles in the middle. I think. That's pretty cool. I like that. Alright, so I've got a bound sword now, so I can get stuff. Yeah, you're um, staying down there. <laughs> what? You're staying down there. I'm not getting near you with that. Yeah? You sure? Really? <laughs> I'm actually curious. I wonder if I put, like, the uh, kill undead things easier thing, if you would die faster as a zombie or a wither. Possibly. Uh, it might check for the entity, and iTunes might be telling everyone, hey, I'm in this entity. Yeah, here, come here. Let me try it. I'm good. Fireball, you, sure, you sure you don't want to test this? Fireball, I think we need a test subject, uh, not me. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to head back to our base, see if I can't get myself a blood shard real quick. Uh, hopefully, because it's nighttime out, I will find some enemies, and then I can kill them. Let's see. Okay. Enemies, enemies, anywhere. Theoretically, no, really. there should be some somewhere. We need to wait a second for them to start spawning. I could also kill these sheep. Maybe. Oh, okay, that would work. All right, I'll be back in a minute, guys. I'm going to try killing a sheep real quick. Yeah, well, I think he dies too fast. There's creepers yeah, behind to, the um, trees. You have to be able to get two hits in. Yeah. Because they have to get weakened first. They're all around yeah. now. <laughs> Soren helping I'm yet again. Good. I'm picking up all the flowers. Oh, I also got a shard. Okay. Oh, I got a weak blood shard. Hooray! I know we need at least, like, one or two. Um, at the very least one. Yeah, you get them a lot better if you don't insta-kill them, like I was doing last episode, yeah. like last season. Because when you insta-kill them, it, it they die before they get to debuff that causes them to drop it. Here's the uh, shards. Well, actually, I'll hold on to these until you get back. Where's that? Yeah, you can just hang Thanks. on to them. Drop them in the A system or something. Okay. So technically, well, no, not really, but soon I'll be able to upgrade. But I can use this to get myself the um, tier 4, I believe it is. Yes, yep. shard. So if you want to make yourself a tier 4 one, you're more than welcome to. The orb? Uh, yeah. I already have it. Oh, you do? I went to Ikus. Oh. What does he have, a bunch of blood shards there? He had many, many, but... Uh... I had to pump out some essence and then filter it back in as I was crafting it because it ran out too quickly. Okay. All right, guys, we'll be back. All right, guys, and like that, we've got ourselves a Master Blood Orb. Hooray! Find it to me, and we're ready to go. And I should probably... What do I do with Way of Time's Master Blood Orb? Did I put it in the AE system? It's probably in our AE system. Wonderful. I'll get it back to him eventually. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, Master Blood Orb up and running. 
uh, ready to do some cool stuff with blood magic. Uh, I think we still have a little bit more work to do, but unfortunately I think it's time to wrap up the episode. So we'll wrap up here, we'll come back next episode, uh, maybe do a little bit of work off camera between now and then, and just prepare for you know a nice automation system. And then we can uh, do some cool stuff and maybe get to uh, doing a quarry with blood magic. We'll see. If we don't have the resources or whatnot. Oh, you know what, Soren? We're out of uh, ME drive space. We're going to need some more drives. Ooh, right. Just a heads up. I'm just going to dump all the stuff that I can in the A system right now. Uh, we'll fix that off camera. All right, guys. For now, Darwell20 signing off. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Take it easy.